hope you're all okay. I'm gonna scare myself half to death tonight. I hope you realise. Prepare yourselves. I haven't played Hellblade before. I'm gonna play it now because the second trailer made me feel things and I felt like I should probably play this. But I hope you're all okay and you're all doing well. Welcome, Chris. I hope you're doing good. Blue! Hello. Deva! Deva! Hello. Hello. I hope you're okay. I hope you had a good week and a weekend. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Wednesday is now Hellblade Day, apart from over Christmas, because, you know, Christmas falls on a Wednesday, so we'll be playing on Friday instead, because I'm at home all day. So we'll be playing some more of this. Um, we've turned the lights down a bit. We've got no music today. I'm putting on a bit of a calmer voice. Um, because some of you are probably listening to this with headphones on, potentially, as you are most of the time, I imagine. Um, but especially with this game. Um, it is best experienced with headphones, as you can probably hear by the music. This game was made with binaural sound. So binaural sound is when they film or they record the sound on a 3D, what is effectively a 3D microphone. So it has ears all the way around it. So it sounds like it's going around you. Um, this game isn't for the faint-hearted, apparently. I have questioned for quite a while whether to play it because I know that it deals with quite serious issues of mental health. Um, I am a sufferer, sufferer of a mental illness, as some of you may know, and I did question whether or not I'd be okay playing this. So I've kind of, sorry, I am gonna pay attention to chat. I just wanted to like do my spiel. Um, so I watched some bits on YouTube. I watched some of the gameplay and I listened to some of the voice the voices that she experiences and felt like I was okay to play this so if you aren't or if you have issues with sort of with psychosis I probably wouldn't recommend watching this game um there is a warning when it loads up saying that if you experience psychosis to you know go steady um but yeah, we're, we're going we're gonna to play this. We're going to experience it rather than play it, I think. But yes, I'm very good, Diva. How are you? I'm, I'm very good. I'm going to say I will watch the part where I finish so I won't spoil it for myself. I've potentially already spoiled part of the ending. I know what the last who... I know who the last boss is. Um, kind of obvious who the last boss is, really, considering. But yeah, I've kind of half spoiled that for myself. But I kind of knew... I kind of guessed anyway but I wasn't prepared for that. Um, yeah, it's it's a tired chill stream all round. Yes, it's Wednesday. It's okay, I got it. You'll hear me if I lose it. Well, yes, that is very true. Uh, what else is going on in the chat? What's going on in the chat? Tired as fucking yourself. This is gonna be fun then. But yeah, I'm, I'm... It's Wednesday. And it's nearly Christmas. So my work is basically everyone going, mm, yeah, I'll do that after Christmas. But my part, my job doesn't do that. It continues over Christmas. So yeah, <laughs> I'm busy. <laughs> um, I was weirded out by the voices, but I mean, I listened to ASMR. So it was like, yeah, see, I, I listened to the first couple of minutes without any of the other sound. It was just the voices and I actually found it weirdly calming. Like it's ended up on my ASMR playlist on YouTube. <laughs> it's Wednesday, my dudes. I'm not gonna shriek because I have made a command for the chat. It's not command; it's a timer um, that basically says I'm going to try and not shriek while I'm playing this. Because as you know, who come in here regularly, I like I I do shriek a lot and I do squeal and I make very weird noises. But I'm gonna try not to with this game, obviously, because of the context and because of the sound. I don't want to ruin it. Um, there's probably gonna be a lot of Kermit concentration face going on in this because I'm just like, oh, the fuck. Um, for the record, backseat gaming is... I am allowing backseat gaming because I'm aware that there are puzzles in this game and I'm not particularly good at puzzles. Um, I tend to get frustrated quite quickly and just Google things, so I will accept help, um, but kind of a as and when when I ask thing. And also just no spoilers, please. Don't spoil it, because, you know, I'll have to come over there and Mordor you and stuff. Like Mordor, M-O-R-D-O-R-R? -R? Yeah. Mordor. I'll have to send the orcs after you. The puzzles aren't overly complicated, don't worry. Oh, that's fine. That's fine then. See, I get conf I, I got confused in, like, Zelda puzzles. <laughs> that's a lot about me, doesn't it? 
because I have some beverage. Uh, lime soda for anyone that's wondering. Because, you know, I wouldn't drink fizzy static water. Um, I found out about backseat gaming, so I'm aware. And I hope I'll add to my streams too. I play a bit, so ask if you need. Oh, thank you, Diva. Thank you, Diva. Spoilers have to do with me and Mitzi. Yes, Mitzi will come at you. Hang on, where is she? Where's the ween? The ween will come get you. Oh, hi, hi, my butt. Hi. How you doing, bud? Hope you're okay. Um. So yeah, should we um, should we get into this? I feel like we should probably get into this because you know that's why you're here. I'll try to do as little talking or as quietly as possible when the cinematics and stuff are on because I'm aware there's quite a lot in this game. Um, but if I'm talking too quietly, just tell me. <laughs> oh, there's a loading button behind me. It's like, yeah, here-ish. It's spinning. But yeah, I downloaded this over two weeks ago and I haven't played it at all. Hello. Who are you? It doesn't matter. Welcome. Also, tell me if the game sound is too quiet. You're safe with me. I'll be right here. Nice and close so I can sneak without alerting the others. That's weird. Let me tell you about Senua. Her story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. This is really weird, but also weirdly calming. <gasps> What's happening? It's breathing something. It's breathing. It's breathing. <gasps> you know she's a little bit. It is for me as well, Diva. That scared the life out of me. <laughs> Hi, Zeno. <laughs> Hello. He's a little bit. Oh, how rude of me. I never told you of the others. Oh, they actually had like a proper mental health Even advisor while they were making this. That's cool. They've been around ever since the tragedy. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Chris. <laughs> Oh yeah, we're not. This is this, this, this whole story. Mm. Changed. To be fair, that trailer was amazing. I think the darkness changed them, just like it changed her. Exactly. We want more Senua. Why isn't she looking? Why aren't you looking, Senua? I can only look around. Up ahead. Do you see it too? I did, Diva. Yes. It is real after all. She's finally arrived in the land of mist and fog. The place the Northmen call hells. I like how the you can you can actually look away from the It's not safe. From the Get it. It's not safe. Oh god, this I really do feel for people who have schizophrenia or any kind of psychosis where they hear voices. It's just so, it's really, it's really distracting. It makes, I'm sorry if I like, I turn a lot. I tend to do that when I listen to ASMR as well, where I kind of move, my head moves to where the voice is. The like I'm trying to hear them better. And it's, it's like, there's no one there, it's my headset. <laughs> This is not a place of rest. I can't do this. Come back, come back. Oh, they're not going back. They're going to do that to you. Can you see them? No, they're not. Can they're fine. They're going to do that to you. Oh, God, that one. I'm just glad Senna's actress got more work. She deserves all this success, especially given that this watching. was her first acting gig. Was it really? Can you feel them watching? I think she was part of the video production team they're for watching. this as well, wasn't she? Is it Mel Melina? Melina? You're so close to the darkness. Go back. <gasps> Can you feel it? I have 
read up a little bit about because I'm quite in interested in um, I can tell you. kind of British history Should and reading up. I didn't know that the Picts existed up until I heard about this game or until I read a bit more into this game. They were a people, you know, a good couple of thousand, you know, they were they were early, ma early, you know, early British settlers or early settlers in Britain. Um, but occupied a very small island, kind of north. You might try and ignore northwest of Scotland. There were very small islands. There weren't many of them. And um, where you're most vulnerable. Barely any of their history exists now, which is sad. Like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see its suffocating power. It's just all the people, like all the bodies and stuff, kind of hanging. There she is. Helena Jergen. Jergens, I guess. There she was. I think she worked on a documentary about the game. Oh, is that the one um, on the you starting screen? It's like Hellblade Feature? I might have to do a potentially. Depending on how long it is, I'll have a look up. We could do a um, just chatting stream and watch that, maybe. I don't know how people would feel about that. Far deeper. Maybe when we're a bit further in, so I don't ruin anything. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna have to start actually playing now. <laughs> PS, yes, we are playing this on PS4. For those wondering. I may have to turn the brightness up a smidge. Because it is very, very dark. I didn't realise it was that dark. Can't really see anything on that left side. What is she looking at? What is she leaving behind? Where is Hello? I don't know what she's thinking. I hear her thoughts. It's not too late to get into the boat and go back. Hi, architect. No one will judge you. Hello. How are you doing? You never know. Hope you're okay. Have you had a good Wednesday? Oh, she heard us. There's no going back. You can't do something. Anyone who has a way a world that conspired to cause so much suffering. There's nothing to go back to, and worse to look forward to. The graphics in this are stunning. Did they say how long ago did this game it? come out? It was a couple of years now, wasn't it? Maybe you too Was it last year? Playing this story. I know I've, I've wanted to play it since it came out, but as I said, it's, it was kind of a bit questionable on my part. I'm just going to see if I can just turn this up a smidge. I know you can, it's like, well, it's barely visible, but my monitor's not that great, and I won't be able to see anything. That's a bit better, I can see now. Right, let's get used to these controls. She's very, I suppose, realistic turning. I'm guessing we don't gather anything, as there's no kind of UI as such. I'm guessing. Hi, Senua. Hello. So it's so much brighter on that monitor. I'm debating whether to switch. I might do on my... Uh... So I'm guessing this is her lover's head. I know of, I know of, I know of, of the head. <laughs> What's um? Look really clearly. Focus, Anwar. Focus. Focus and you'll see. What happens if you focus? Do you focus? Do you focus? <laughs> it doesn't explain anything. Uh, focus, R2. Okay. Do oh. not forget my story, Senua. Because you're... Do not forget... Oh, you actually have to focus the whole time. Okay. Because your darkness comes from hell and your fate lies there Shit. they say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to hell's gate but gods and the there's no tutorials really so make a mental note of the controls from the menu it's handy because you can just press options you must leave the of Orkney across the eastern sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep dark valleys after nine nights of riding you will follow a great river and will find a bridge covered in gold. The path to Helheim 
goes from there. I'm guessing the game's pretty Across linear the in of knives, where you go. Echoes from the dark world of Niflheim. Ooh, a quite cool. Okay, is that it? Okay. If you guys like Thor the History, it's good to be here. <laughs> Quite big on um, just history in general. I did history for GCSE, and you know, as an adult now, I kind of wish I um, took it into um, A level. The circle always to hop over, or she did that on her own. Okay, question: How do you run? Run L one. So disorientating. She's not stopping. Not this time. Oh, oh wow. Can you see it? Oh. The mist and fog. Is it bad? Pretty linear is fairly short. Two took me about six hours. Oh. What was it he said? My intention was to stream it today and next Friday, and then potentially into January. The place they call Helheim. I'm pretty slow with games, though. I like I'm I'm an explorer. I like kind of thundering around and looking at things. So I'm hoping I get a little bit more out of it. But it's just so pretty. Oh, it's breathing. I hear you. So he's there. You know. There's no doubt about he's it. Us. The source of the darkness is I get your dick. I the goddess. I hope you're okay. Holds his soul there. Her dear beloved. I've read that I'm probably going to cry while I play this. But yeah, hi Chaotic, I hope you're okay and you're having a good day. Hi Cross, how are you doing? Still need to get this game, yes you do. It's. I think it's still on sale on the PS4 store if you want to grab it, if you can afford it just before Christmas. Why doesn't she turn back? Do I need to, I'm, guess, I'm guessing I'll just walk over here. Quite a nice beach, generally, you know, so even though that's basically hell. She needs to save his soul. Keep the hell. She wants his soul to be at peace. He needs to lay him to rest. I love this game. I definitely did cry. Oh, bless you. Have you finished it? She's going to save him. She's not peace. She'll never make it to hell. <laughs> she can't. Normally they don't bother with like tiny little things like that. Just having a little wake. And you know, your clothes be dragging. Just tiny little things about this game that I loved when I was you know, the videos that I have watched of it. I'm guessing that's the bridge that I need to cross. But I need to figure out how to get up there. Don't know where you the bridge are. to Hellheim. I forget its name. No, that just shimmy up. She forgets too. Almost completely done with it. How long she have you been playing it, Chaotic? Cross it. That part wasn't so easy to forget. The old fool said there was a hidden path up to it. Let's see, shall we? Hi, Watchy! Well, how are How are you doing, BB? I know, right? <laughs> what are you doing back over here in the land of purple? <laughs> Watchy um, actually streams on Mixer now. For the, I think you stream entirely on Mixer now, don't you, Watchy? Um, if I know that's his Twitch link, but it's the same on um, Mixer. So if you want to check him out on Mixer instead, he's an awesome streamer. The guy to watch on Mixer, in my opinion. 
Same for Chris. You do you stream entirely on Mixer now, Chris? There's a wild watchy, a wild watchy appears. It's just like I can't look at that. Look at that. Who do who? It's about watchy exactly. For now, I'm going through a phase of rebounding ish. Ooh, I know, right, Chris? Look at that. That's. This is just. This isn't even a pro. I don't have a PS4 Pro. This is just PS4. You got. D d stop turning away. Okay, you can face that way then. Just like, look at that. That's just PS4. Like, I can't imagine what this looks like in 4K. I'm guessing this is the path we need to take. There's a room thing over there. I'm guessing I need to read those. Uh, those are dead people over there, so I'm gonna go this way. I do recommend, like, if you, I don't, I'm a very weird one in the context that I find this kind of, the voices are quite soothing. Like, I don't find them scary. But, um, check out ASMR if you don't already. The Northmen Ooh. speak of nine worlds. The world of men, they call That's Midgar. Us. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of earth, harvest, wind, and sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones is fairly in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of game is great. It's fantastic visual dogs. and auditory stuff really get you into the game. I know. I already am. I'm just like Helheim, <laughs> and that is where you must travel. Uh, I don't think there's meant to be soothing or scary for that matter. It's more that they're just sort of there. Yeah, it's. Like, <laughs> I know I've already apologised for it, but my head will tilt when they talk. It's. I don't know. It's a bit of a tick, or uh, no, it's not a tick, is it? That's insulting to people who do suffer with ticks. How do I climb? Oh, like this. Oh, I didn't even see there was a ladder there. Don't, don't look down, don't look down, but I want to look down. <laughs> I do, like, I'm probably going to say this about a hundred million times, but I really do feel for people who suffer with psychosis. Because to have that all the time, to have, you know, people in your head, it must be very, re like, I f I'm finding it disorientating. Stop, you can't. You're in danger. Stop. 